Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Emma. Today we're doing a dossier review. I'm actually partnered with Dossier and today I want to just talk about their products and what my honest opinions are. I've had their perfume now since January and it's currently almost the end of February. I thought after wearing them for a few months I'd be able to give you some of my opinions. I got sent like I have eight different scents of theirs and they're all different. So we talk about those. I can describe each one, rate them for you. So when you order Dossier, they come in these cute little boxes and inside is your perfume and then a little, don't worry, it was just the boxes and a little sheet talking about the scent. One thing I will say about Dossier perfumes is they are super travel friendly. I've actually already traveled with them and it didn't leak at all. And also the size amount in here is 1.7 fluid ounces, so it travels well. If you're like me and you don't like committing to something online, especially a perfume where you can't smell it before you buy it, Dossier actually is now sold in Walmart. If you're an in-store shopping person, that's another option for you. Okay, I think we're gonna start with my favorite smells and we're just gonna like go down the line. Starting with number one, this is the very first smell I got and I'm still attached to it. Ambery Vanilla is the smell. If you like the smell of vanilla, honestly, I think this one's for you. All of my friends also like this one the most. It's just a really good everyday smell. Next, at number two, we have Floral Violet. This one is actually a dupe for the Marc Jacobs um, Daisy Perfume, which I also have, but I haven't touched it in two months because I always use this one. It's super similar to the Marc Jacobs Daisy, and I reach for this one more. Number three is Gourmand. Okay, if I butcher this name, just don't come for me. It's Gourmand White Flowers. I get a little hint of vanilla, but it's it's a more floral vanilla, which I like. It's also kind of caramely. I don't know. It's a very warm smelling scent. Also a very good every day. You definitely only need one spray of this to get the job done. We're at number four now. We have powdery coconut. Honestly, this one's pretty self-explanatory. It kind of smells like a combination of coconut and baby powder, which... I definitely have reached for this one a few times. Definitely not my everyday smell. I feel like I'll reach for this a lot more in the summer. Number five is Citrus Peony. Um, this one, this one's a little more like lively. It's very, I guess, smells like citrus with a little hint of flowers, but definitely more of a spring smell. I feel like, again, I'll be reaching for it more as the year progresses. Right now it's winter, so the vanilla smells are right up my alley. Okay, I'm down to my last three. I don't really want to rate these because... I don't know. Okay. I think I can agree this is my number six. It's the Floral Honeysuckle. This is also one of the first smells I've gotten. I reached for it a lot until I got more scent to me. It smells almost identical to Gucci and Bloom. We're on down to seven and eight. I think these are my least favorite only because they're more masculine. I'm gonna have to say Ambery Saffron is my number seven. It's very tangy. When I smell it, it's kind of like a lot. It's like a kind of woody, orangey smell. I like I could give this to someone else and I feel like they would wear it every day. It's just not, it's not for me. And that leaves our number eight, which is Woody Oak Moss. I mean, you can kind of tell from these names that they're gonna be more masculine smells. It just smells like a typical cologne. I don't hate it, but I just, I think I'd like the smell more on someone else, just like the last one. I know this video was short and quick, but I just wanted to rate these smells for you. If you have any questions, go ahead and comment them down below. I'm so glad to be working with this brand because I feel like this is something I use every single day and I genuinely recommend it to my friends. Like they actually ask to come use my perfume all the time just because it smells so good. And if you're watching this video and you made it this far, either you really like Dossier or you should probably subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. All right, y'all. Bye.